In 2024, we unveiled MDA Aurora, our software-defined digital satellite product line, a pioneering solution to drive the growing space economy. The world is more connected than ever. With MDA Aurora, we make it possible to connect anytime, anywhere, whether broadband connecting governments and industries to the most remote locations, or direct to device where we're able to connect people and their cell phones directly to satellites. We're helping to close the digital divide and make connectivity accessible to everyone. The challenge we need to solve for the broadband software-defined satellite is to provide a very high capacity with a lot of flexibility as well as reliability. The Direct Editing Array, or DRA, solves part of that challenge by providing very high power spot beams that are flexible so they can point to any direction using electronic steering and digital beamforming. So at the heart of the satellite, we have an onboard processor that we call the OVP, and this processor is capable of routing tens of gigabit per second of data traffic, either locally or through the whole constellation. It is compliant to DVB standards, and it's powered by a very advanced software that can manage thousands of users simultaneously. Those subsystems are supported by a platform which basically is very efficient power-wise and also designed for high volume manufacturing. The challenge for the D2D market is actually quite different. What we're trying to do is to close a link between a cell phone and a satellite that can be thousands of kilometers away. Our DTD product focuses on a DRA that is extremely large in diameter, such that we can effectively establish this connection with the user. In this case, our onboard processor is compliant to 3GPP standards and particularly the 5G NTN standard, and eventually we're preparing it to be compliant also to 6G standards. The platform product for D2D packs a lot of innovation. It has a platform factor such that we can stack multiple of those on the same launcher. It is very efficient and high power, and also it's designed with high volume manufacturing in mind, which is at the core of the value proposition for both of our products. Both the direct-to-device and the broadband products are actually driven by innovation and flexibility. So they are pushing the limits of what satellites can do. It's not only about what our satellites do, it's how we're building them. When I started, we were producing one satellite every two years. Now we're working at producing two per day. We're working alongside machine learning and robotics to create the building blocks that will allow us to develop an automated process and streamline every step. This automation means that we can build multiple constellations at the same time. It's incredible progress. The exciting part is what this innovation makes possible. We're not just connecting people, we're connecting industries, like agriculture and automotive and devices of all kinds anywhere across the globe. The possibilities are endless, and this really is just the beginning.